everyone, it's me, and I'm here to do a TJ Masks, TJ, I can't talk today, I keep dropping things, I can't talk, my phrases are incorrect, I don't know what I'm doing anymore, anyway, I'm doing a TJ Maxx and Marshalls a haul, like, kind of like together haul, like a collective haul, because it's makeup, and I went to both places, and I found a lot of makeup, so let's get into it. So here is the bag right here. It's the TJ Maxx bag. I kind of just stuck the Marshall stuff in here. Let's get started. I'm just going to start pulling stuff out of this bag, and I'll just show you guys what I got, okay? So I needed a new beauty blender, and I love Marshall's and TJ Maxx's brands of their beauty blenders. Um, even though they're just like off-brand cosmetic sponges, they still really do work. You don't need to buy the $20 beauty blender. You can get like a $4 one, and it still is the exact same. It might not be like as high-end obviously but it's pretty much the same so I got their polished um, flawless beauty bl makeup blender um, cosmetic sponge and I got the pink one I do have a light orange one that is kind of beat up because I have nails and I like dig into it and so it kind of tears it up a little bit but I did get a pink one this time so I'm really excited for that and I can already tell you little I can already tell you I love them I love them I love them I have a different one too I don't remember what color it is I think it was purple. I actually just threw that one away because it was getting kind of old. So picked up another one. All right, the next thing I got from Marshalls. Oh, and I got this from TJ Maxx and it was a $3.99. Next thing I got at Marshalls, this was a steal, you guys. It was a super steal and I saw this in the back room when I was unloading. So I was like, heck yeah, I gotta get this. So this is the um, Baked Color and Contour Sunset Glow. It has highlight, blush, and bronzer sculptor for $9. 99 Laura Geller you guys I have already used this because I couldn't help myself it was just too amazing to not use yet but it's beautiful Hold on. drop this has like exactly how to use it and everything like the steps I don't need that don't want it but look oh, this is so beautiful it's so beautiful and the colors are gorgeous so sorry it's a little dirty in here because like I said I have used it already but it comes with a mirror and then you've got your blush right here, which is gorgeous, you guys. It's gorgeous. It's kind of more light and it's shimmery, but it's beautiful. Then you got the bronzer over here, which again is gorgeous. So we're going to put that right there. This is perfect for my olive skin tone. It's just, I don't know, it's just really great. So I use this to just not contour so much, but I use it to bronze. I use a different contour color from her line. but um, And then you got the vanilla the vanilla highlights. I've never used her highlight before, but this stuff, you guys, oh, freaking fabulous. Like, look at this. Look at that highlight. Like, that is gorgeous. It's so shiny and glimmery. And you would not have thought, at least I wouldn't have thought, looking at this pan, that that would be so shiny because these other ones are shining better than that one. But, oh my God, it's beautiful, you guys. It's so beautiful. Love this. If you guys can get your hands on that at a Marshalls or a TJ Maxx, do it because it's totally worth it. Okay. It's, it's worth it. And get this off my face right now. Okay. So it doesn't say what colors those are. Cause I wonder if it does. Oh, okay. So the, um, the bronzer was in Hawaiian glow. The, uh, blusher was in tropic hues and the highlighter was in French vanilla. Really pretty. Um, overall at TJ Maxx, I did pick up this Yes to Grapefruit Correct and Repair um, Brightening Peel. It's a pore perfection mask. I really, really, really needed a pore perfection mask because my pores are so big right now. I don't know why, but they're so big, especially right in here on both my sides and my nose. They're just huge. So I picked this up for $5.99. Not bad of a price. And this is what it looks like. I'm very excited to try this. I haven't tried it yet. I haven't even really, I haven't even opened it actually. So, oh, yes, I have. Sorry, I wanted to smell it, I guess. <laughs> but it just smells like grapefruits. If you're not a big fan of grapefruit, you're not going to like this. But these are all natural products, and I really do like Yes To. Love them so much. I love the Yes To Tomatoes line, especially because it has to deal with um, acne and has salicylic acid in it and stuff. So giving Yes To Grapefruits a try out for my pores. Um, the next thing in here I did grab three of. These are the Cap on D, and I'm pretty sure you guys have seen this going around YouTube. I know I have. I've been watching a lot of Marshalls and TJ Maxx videos. Um, these are the Kat Von D Lightning Liners, and they're metallic eyeliners. They re they're retailing right now at Marshalls for $7.99. That's not a bad price at all for Kat Von D. So I got three different colors. I got this one in Amadeus, 
which is a really nice silver. It's like a silver rose gold color. I'm going to, I don't know if I'm going to test these out for you guys just because I haven't put together all of them. I just put together the brown one, the bronzy one, because there's like so much you have to do. Let me put it together for you. All right, you guys. So Amadeus, I feel like I've been fooled. This doesn't look like silver to me. Well, I guess it does on the camera. Now I feel dumb. It kind of looks like in person, it looks like it's going to be like a, a peachy kind of silver, like a rose gold kind of silver, but it's straight up silver, you guys. So I went ahead and, and I screwed them up and everything. So let's go ahead and give them a shot. I have not tested these yet, but holy crap. Holy jamole. It's like a white silver. Oh yeah. That will actually look really pretty. Like if you put it like underneath, and then put it on your wing or like right above your wing. Oh, that would be gorgeous. That is really pretty actually. So really excited about that one. Um, the next one that I picked up was this black one in the color Jet. And it's just like a black, again, $7.99. We're going to go ahead and test this. I kind of squirted it up a little too far. I'm sorry, you guys, but you're going to get a good swatch. You're going to get a good swatch. This one is just like a sparkly, like it has... This is really gorgeous in person. Like, I wish you guys could see this in person, or you guys can just go out and buy it, you know? But it is gorgeous. It has, like, flecks of blue and silver glitter running through it. Oh, so freaking pretty, you guys. So freaking pretty. I might just pop that on top of the shadow liner I have on right now. And then the one I have been wearing is this brown one in the color Hide. And this is just, like, a bronzy color. Again, $7.99. This color is gorgeous. It's kind of hard to apply these liners just because there are um, liquid sparkles. Ooh, what was that? What was that? I don't know. Why is this so hard to come out right now? Why are you doing this to me? You were just working for me the other day. Come on. Come on. This was literally just working for me the other day. Like, I'm not sure what's happening right now. I gotta shake it up, maybe. Up oh, there we go. Okay, so let's go ahead and put some of this on. This is a bronzier, bronzier, like more neutral color. I wore this to work one day. It's pretty. It has just the tiniest fleck of gold in there, and it's just gorgeous, you guys. These colors are amazing. If you have not picked these up at your local Marshalls or TJ Maxx, do so because I'm telling you, you're not gonna regret it at all. Like they're gorgeous, freaking gorgeous. Okay, on to the next. Oh, I just made a mess. Oh, great. And they, oh, by the way, they don't budge. Like, this one has already dried, and it's not coming off because I just tried wiping it off. It's not going anywhere. It's not going anywhere. Okay, so I did pick up a Bare Minerals uh, Marvelous Moxie Lipstick, and this was $6.99. This is in the color Take Charge. I have already bought, like, a couple of them before. I don't think I included them in any videos because it was before I started making these videos. But this one is a little different than the one that I do have. It has, like, this little button right here, and I think you, like, push it or something. How, how do you do this? Uh, ah! <laughs> so you push this little button up, see? Push it up. The lipstick comes out. Anyway, this color is a really, really pretty neutral color. It's kind of like a pinky nude, I guess you can say. But I'm going to go ahead and swatch it right here for you. And it's so creamy and it's beautiful. Like, that is beautiful. If it'll just focus on the swatch. Beautiful. This sun right here is, like, coming in and is, like, blinding me. I'm, like, trying to get in a position to where you can actually see me and the swatches. But really pretty it's exactly what it looks like in the color it's probably a little bit more pink versus nude in the actual tube but you guys it's gorgeous so definitely pick up these they are $6.99 they are super inexpensive and they are good for your bang good bang for your buck is what i meant to say okay next thing i got is this steel eyeshadow which i have already used it was $7.99 bam $7.99 and this is in the color I don't know right now because I'm trying to rip this box open because apparently it doesn't want to open for me per usual. That's how Joni's life always works. This is in the color Black Diamond. And I'll tell you guys, I was a little underwhelmed with these. Um, Stila Shadows, I've never really tried. Um, it comes off really great on a pigment on your finger, but then when you kind of swatch it, it kind of just disappears. Like it, I don't know. I mean, it turns into like some kind of 
just doesn't look as pigmented as it does on your finger or in the pan itself. Very underwhelmed. I did try to wear this, and that was a horrible swatch. I'm so sorry, you guys. I did try to wear this, like, on top of my lid just to kind of smoke out my eye, and it just did not work for me. I don't know. I wasn't, I was very underwhelmed with this. So if you guys see these Stila shadows, if you're a fan of them, grab them. If you're not, and you're kind of iffy on them, I would just say just pass them up. They're not worth it. I mean, they are $7.99. They're going to be a lot less um, inexpensive than you would buy them at the actual store. But I don't know if it's worth your bang. I mean, it'd be maybe pretty if you just wanted to maybe do like a liner with it. I don't know. Okay, and this next one was also, that, was, that one was from Marshalls, by the way. This one's from TJ Maxx. This is the Bite Beauty. I've never seen Bite Beauty come into my Marshalls, but I did see them at TJ Maxx, and I was like, I gotta pick them up. And this one has not been used because it's, like, all taped up and everything, so on the top and bottom. So I was like, heck yeah, because all the ones were, like, used. It was disgusting. This is in the color Quince, and this was, like I said, at TJ Maxx for $9.99. And we're gonna have to try to rip in this box because I don't know how I'm gonna open this otherwise, so... Let's rip into this box without damaging ugh, the goods, you know? Can't damage the goods. You just gotta, you gotta try to, try to pull up the tape, I guess. The heck do they do this? You know, we have these over at, oh, there we go. We have these over at work too, but we actually are not allowed to use them anymore. Um, we used something different. So let's get into this sucker. These Bite Beauty lipsticks, $9.99. Like seriously, come on. Oh, this is a beautiful color. This is a beautiful color. This this one was one that was already open, but this one wasn't open. It has not been used. It's gorgeous, you guys. Freaking gorgeous. So let's go ahead and I don't want to do a terrible swatch for you guys. We'll just do it right here. Look at that color. That color is amazing. Oh, that color is so nice. You know what this will look good on? If you were to wear this and rock like a really nude look like me and just like put some false lashes on and then just pop this on and wear like a really nice like kind of like mauvey top this would be so gorgeous with it that color is so pretty mm, perfect so those are all these steals that I did find at Marshalls and TJ Maxx these past couple of weeks I hope that you guys enjoyed if you guys want to see more videos like this please be sure to give this video a big old thumbs up because I love doing these videos especially as I work at Marshalls it's really easy for me to find these things first. So if you guys want to see more videos like this, give me a big old thumbs up. Let me, down the, let me know down in the comments. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel and hit that bell to keep up with notifications, okay? Love you guys. Bye.